Hey everybody, just finished another workout and wanted to show you another thing that's really common with folks that I'm training. So here's my Morpheus at my app today. I did some intervals after I did a little bit of a warm up, and you can see I've got some ups and downs there and you can see I'm kind of leveling there because what I'm doing is I'm cycling through a little bit of just gentle warm ups and then I go into some speed up and slow down kind of Tabata style 15 second fast and 60 second recovery more or less interval sessions. So you can see I'm starting to increase here, but you'll notice I'm still in the blue zone. And if we move this guy, now you can see on the top, I start to get more into the conditioning zone. Now I had 10 speed up and slow down sets, much like a Tabata, but in my case, I was going 15 seconds hard and then 60 seconds slow. So changing it up just a little bit from the usual. But you notice that I don't get into these green guys here, getting into the conditioning zone till I've been through a couple sets there of the blue where I'm still in recovery zone. Now, what does this mean? Well, to get max effect out of your intervals, you wanna make sure that you're getting into the conditioning zone at the top of each and every one of your intervals. So what does this mean? More warm up might be necessary to get the heart rate up to a higher rate before you jump in to these intervals. Ultimately, the goal is to be able to speed the heart rate up as fast as possible and drop it back down as fast as possible. That means a well-conditioned heart. So what you're seeing here with me is I'm working on things and I'm a work in progress, just like many folks. And over the next eight weeks, you'll see this improve where I can get up into those higher rate zones and bring myself back down. You'll also notice that I do have a little bit of red in here. Ooh, there goes my finger, red. I did get into some high max zones on those. So when you max out, you wanna make sure that you are keeping it in check because maxing out over and over again throughout a whole workout for more than you know even 10 minutes, that's gonna really drain you and you're gonna need to recover more. Now, am I saying don't do it? No, I'm just saying you gotta watch that. The more you max out, the more you're gonna have to pay attention to your recovery. So in this case, you can see I got into the green zone quite a bit here and blue kind of half and half of sorts, which is great. I'm gonna pay attention to my recovery tomorrow and see how I did. So one tip, just thinking about things as you're working on your fitness and trying to get some results, make sure you get into the conditioning zone when you're doing your intervals so that you know you are getting your mitochondria primed up and you're able to speed that metabolism up a little bit. For more information, stay tuned.